Who is going to be the team that surprises the league the most? See, now i got to pull up teams. So the Giants could be in the conversation, but nobody's going to talk about them because they're not going to be like a 12-win team. Um, but I think they'll probably surprise some people. Dallas could be a bit of a surprise team, but some people are talking about them. Also, they also I would say it's as likely they surprise for how much they suck as it is that they surprise for as good as they are. And the biggest reason I say that, the talent level for the team means they could actually be quite good. But Mike McCarthy's their head coach, which means he's he is the master of convincing everybody this is going to be a new year and everything's going to be different. And you all better watch out and then just massively underperforming. So right now there's getting a ton of hype for Dallas. A lot of people are looking at it. They look at the offensive talent that they have, despite the fact that like a lot of teams who don't want to ever listen to me, they allowed their offensive line to erode. Um but aside from that, they've got the weapons, but the defense was just putrid. And the only thing that we've really got is an assurance from Mike McCarthy that the defense is massively turned around, which how many times did we hear that in Green Bay? Um, so people are starting to hype up Dallas, and it's possible Dallas is terrible. Um, Jacksonville, I'm not expecting a bounce back. Houston, I'm not expecting anything. The Chargers, I don't really expect anything. Uh, Washington, I don't expect anything. Seattle, no. Indy, no. Giants, uh, Giants, Maybe. Uh, I like the coaching staff. I like the fact that they're bringing in the Shanahan system, which is going to make it easier for their quarterback, who seemed to look pretty good. They brought in a couple weapons. Uh, Defensively, their new head coach is a very intelligent defensive mind. I'm not saying necessarily playoffs, but if you're talking about a team that's going to kind of uh, surprise, maybe. Um the Vikings possibly, but again, it's 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 hard to know because it's a matter of not only how good are they going to be, but what is the actual perception. If if people think the Vikings are going to be an eight-win team, they could surprise. If people think they're going to be a 10-win team, which is what I actually think, I don't think they're going to surprise. Bengals are not going to surprise. I think the Bengals are going to be terrible. Um, Arizona, Tennessee, San Francisco, Detroit, Pittsburgh, Buffalo, Philly, Atlanta, Cleveland, Kansas City. I got I don't have much. New Orleans could possibly be in the conversation. I know I've been kind of dumping on them, um, but only because they're, they're expected to, it's like a three-point favor for the Packers, which surprises me. But if Jameis can just be somewhat competent, um, they could be better than some people are expecting. But again, I don't know what people are expecting because based on the fact that we're only three-point favorites, maybe people think New Orleans is just going to be good. I don't know. I don't know if I have a team. That I'm, I'm expecting New England maybe would be on that list. If, if Mac can continue what he's doing, you got Bill Belichick who's obviously doing what he's doing. He can maybe do something special with the defense. You've got um, a quarterback that can execute what you need him to execute. Maybe that's the team as much as it makes me sick to say that. So I haven't put a lot of thought into it, but that would be maybe maybe my thought on that. I'm not sure.